Hi guys, so the weather is heating up lately. It's gonna be a beautiful weekend and what better time to do a demonstration against some tanning lotions that I have used in the past and showing you what I love currently at the moment. So in this um, video, I'm gonna be doing a quick demo comparison video against the Bondi Sands, against the Instaglow. So with the tan, I love to tan, always have loved to tan. When I was younger, I used to do it all the time. As I became a mum, um, it started to get a little bit trickier, a little bit hard to fit it in, because usually with the tan, when I first started out, I would always go and pay someone to do it. Then the husband found out how much I was spending a week on going to get a spray tan, and he thought that was ridiculous, so he bought me a spray tanning gun machine so I could do it at home. Um, and then he was doing it for me, spraying me um, once a week at home, which was great, you know, saved money, but it was still very messy. Um, and then you've got to wait for it to dry. So you're walking around the house like a bloomin' oompa loompa, waiting for it to dry, which is a pain in the butt, especially when you've got little toddlers and kids that want to be picked up. Um, yeah, so I found it very, very um, time consuming. So the important things I look for now when um, I'm looking for a tan, being a busy mum of four, so the main important things to me is it's got to be instant, it's got to dry quickly, I don't want to wash it off and it's got to look natural. So first up, I'm going to put the Bondi Sands to the test. Um, I used to really, really love this one. What I don't like about it, having to apply it with a mitt, having then to wait hours then to wash it off, and then you hop into bed and then it comes off on your sheets. So they're the things I don't like about it. So let's put it to the test. So that's the Bondi Sands. So it's on. You then have to wait four to six hours then to wash it off. Um, so I'm now going to pair it, compare it to the one I'm currently using, um, Instaglow. And what I love about this, it dries within 20 minutes. You don't need to wash it off and you do not need to apply it with a mitt. So I'll show you. And it also gives you a nice bronzy glow, like a shimmer. And it goes on a lot easier, feels a lot less stickier than the Bondi Sands. So I'm going to, I've just applied that with my hand. Now, how do you wash your hand? How do you not get orange hands? Follow me. So you see my hand, how I've got the tan on the hand. All you need to do, so, and wash it off like that. And you don't get orange hands, nothing like that. Queen. So I have done Bondi Sands on this arm and I have done Instaglow on this arm. So we'll leave it a while and we'll see which turns out better. It's really patchy here and it's made my skin really, really dry. Can you see the patchiness of it? And then with the other one, it's nice and even. There's no patchiness and it's not dry. It doesn't feel dry at all. 